Let's fix calls if they're not working on your iPhone. Now, if you're trying to call somebody and it's not going through, maybe you have bad signal, I'm gonna walk you through a bunch of different steps to get all those calls working. Now, the first and easiest thing we'll do is swipe down from the top right, and you can see right next to the airplane mode is a cell signal. So if that is kind of gray like that, grayed out, you're just gonna tap it to turn it on and make sure that it's green so that you can connect to a carrier network, wherever it may be. So the next step that we can do is let's go into the settings and we'll tap on cellular right under Bluetooth. Now you can see here I have cellular data and turn this line on associated with my eSIM. So what you could do is you could toggle turn this line on and then you could toggle that off and then you can go back and turn it back on. This basically reactivates this line so that you reconnect. I have AT&T, I reconnect to AT&T, Sprint, T-Mobile, Verizon, whatever it may be. So you can go through these steps to make sure that your cell signal is turned on. Now, another thing that you can do that is really helpful is right under turn this line on is Wi-Fi calling. So I can go in there and I can turn this on. Basically what this means is if I have bad cell signal, it will use my Wi-Fi network to help boost that cell signal and use some of the data through Wi-Fi to just make sure that that call is nice and complete and crisp sounding, it's not getting failed or dropped calls. Now, another thing that you can do going through all of these steps is that you can always try to use FaceTime audio, which is essentially making an audio call like you normally would, but it's going only through either your internet, your Wi-Fi, or your mobile data, cell data, whatever you may have. So let's go over and we'll just find FaceTime here. Uh, open up FaceTime and then you can tap on new FaceTime and then you can just type in somebody's name here now keep in mind right next to at the bottom right above that queue is just a little phone you can always do just an audio call on FaceTime it doesn't have to be a video call and essentially it works the exact same as making a normal call with them however as I said before this goes through Wi-Fi or cell data so even if you have bad signal it still works really well. Now the last thing you can do is hop into your settings and let's go back and back again and we'll tap on general and then at the very top top tap on about. Now here you can see if I scroll down you can see these modem firmware, the IMEI and all of these, the network, the network carrier. Now in all of these where it says the carrier and all of these different things, if you go to this page and it pops up with the alert that you need to update your firmware, then basically just update the firmware associated with your carrier so that you can connect to your carrier. And a lot of times if you're having any bugs or issues, updating this will help you out. Now the last thing that you can do is just restart your phone. You can tap the volume up, the volume down, and then tap and hold on that side button until your phone shuts down completely, force shuts down, and then you can restart it. And a lot of times that fixes any kind of call issues. Hope this helps. If you have any questions on that, leave them in the comments down below, and I'll catch you on the next one.